Appalachian Wireless now has new forward pay pricing, where you can pay up front and get the data and features you desire. Five gigabytes of data, just $39.99. Unlimited, just $79.99. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. As you know, America is symbolized by the bald eagle, which is a creature that is inspiring in its magnificence. But this winter, one of those eagles found itself struggling for survival. What happened next was a community effort that paid off on Saturday. Dozens of people were at Paintsville Lake this weekend watching as a bald eagle was returned to nature. Saturday's release was the final step in a long journey for the creature who faced an almost certain death if not for its unlikely discovery. After work I usually walk up the holler just as a stress reliever and as I was walking up the holler one particular day when we were about 10 degrees had about three inches of snow on the ground the further up the holler I went I saw a dark object in the snow and I thought it might have been a coyote um, but the closer I got I saw it was an eagle and I couldn't believe that it was an eagle. The eagle had no apparent injuries but was unable to fly. It was ultimately turned over to Liberty Nature Center in Somerset to bring the bird back to health. She could not stand up, so she was just laying flat. Her feet were really extremely cold, and we found a pocket of infection on one of the legs. So when we got her back, we started her on antibiotics, gave her some Moxicam for her pain, and started physical therapy immediately on both feet. On Saturday, spectators had a few moments to marvel at the creature before it was set free. Hutchison says he sees a greater plan in the string of improbable events that led to Saturday's release. Realize that you're, you see right in front of you not only the national bird, the national animal, and what a majestic species it is. Uh, I, I feel honored, blessed that I was able to find this bird on this particular night uh, because I did not take my normal routine as I walked. God works in mysterious ways and we don't question it. I'm just glad I was part of it. The 14-pound eagle was not equipped with a tracking device, leaving its future contact with humanity up to chance. Reporting at Painesville Lake, I'm Ralph Davis for EKB News.